Wonders like the Grand Canyon and Victoria Falls are certainly big, and anyone who sees them will surely be impressed, but sheer size isn't enough to truly leave a person in awe. There are other places in this world, though, that are far stranger. Places that seem almost alien, as if they could only exist on a planet that evolved separately from our own. These are places that scientists have had to struggle just to understand how they ever could have been formed, let alone explain them. Places that will truly make you wonder and think that the seven wonders of the natural world may have been named too quickly. Not just because they're beautiful, but because they seem to follow scientific laws that don't exist anywhere else on Earth. Here is a list of 10 places in the world that science cannot explain. But before we get into that, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Number 10. Shanae Timpishka, The Boiling River Deep in the Amazon lies a river four miles long and unlike any other on Earth. The Shanae Timpishka is so hot that any animal that steps into it gets boiled alive. When an unlucky creature wanders in, the eyes cook first melting in its skull. Soon, the animal is in too much pain to keep swimming to safety. Water fills its mouth and lungs, and it's cooked from the inside out. The river gets as hot as 196 degrees Fahrenheit, and scientists aren't completely sure why. Normally, water that gets this hot is fed by a volcano, but this one is 700 kilometers away from the nearest one. There is a theory, though. Scientists believe that boiling hot water from under the earth cracks through fault lines and heats up the river, making the water a geothermal system unlike any other on earth, but nothing has been confirmed, and it is still a mystery. Number 9. Moval Cave, the cave with an atmosphere of sulfur. In southeast Romania, there's a cave that was locked away from the slightest ray of light for 5.5 million years, and that has a completely different atmosphere from the Earth. The cave was discovered by workers looking to set up a power plant. They tested the ground to see if it was a safe place to build, and cracked open a pathway that leads into one of the strangest places on Earth. If you descend through the narrow shaft and pass a series of tunnels, you enter a chamber with a lake of sulfuric water stinking of rotten eggs. The air there is toxic, filled with hydrogen sulfide and contaminated with 100 times the surface levels of carbon dioxide. The strangest part, though, is that a whole ecosystem has survived inside of it. Researchers have found 33 species inside the cave that don't exist anywhere outside of it. They've adapted to survive in a sulfuric environment, living by feeding off foam on top of the stones. Survival comes in the strangest forms. Number 8. The Petrifying Well, where water turns things to stone. In Knaresboro in North Yorkshire is a well that seems like something ripped out of a story by Sidney Sheldon. It's a place where water trickles down a cliffside that looks like a skeleton smiling face, and where anything you place under the water will turn to stone. The process usually takes three to five months, but you can leave anything you own under the trickling water, and when you return, it will have turned to stone. People have left everything from teddy bears to bicycles there, and every one of them has been transformed into a statue. For a long time, people believed that the well was cursed by a witch. Scientists today, though, have found that the water just has unusually high mineral content. As a result, it creates a hard mineral shell over anything it touches, just like how stalactites are formed in caves. But it's still a mystery how the well got there. Number 7. Lake Karache, the most radioactive lake on Earth. Inside of what was once a Soviet Union nuclear weapons factory is a lake pumped full of more radioactive material than anywhere else on Earth. Lake Karache is so radioactive that you would only have to stand near it for an hour for it to kill you. The lake was used by the Soviet Union to dump their nuclear waste. They poured obscene amounts into it, and it caused major problems. In 1957, 
An explosion in the factory spread the radioactive particles in the lake around 9,000 square miles. Then, in 1967, the waters dried up and the radioactive dust was blown a further 900 miles away. Today, the water is mostly covered up with concrete to keep these disasters from happening again. The area is still so toxic, though, that it makes Chernobyl look like a family-friendly tourist destination. Number 6. Gruner Sea, the park that goes underwater every spring. In Austria, there's a park with beautiful hiking trails and benches you can jog through in autumn morning. If you visit in the spring, though, it's a little bit different. In fact, you're going to need some scuba gear. The park is near the Hoshua Mountains, which get completely covered with snow in the winter. There's so much snow on the mountains that, when it melts, the park's lake doubles in size and drowns the park. If you swim through it in the spring, you'll see benches and bridges under the water. Even some of the alpine flowers, which normally only survive above the surface, will bloom under the water. Then, partway through the summer, when the water starts to recede, the park emerges from underneath. Number 5. The Double Tree of Casorzo In the countryside of Piemont, Italy, there's an unusual sight. There's a cherry tree there that looks, in most respects, just like any other healthy cherry tree, except that it happens to grow directly on top of a mulberry tree. This isn't completely unprecedented. Parasitic trees have grown out of others before, but normally, they're small, stunted things that live short lives before falling off. The double tree of Casorzo, though, consists of two fully formed, healthy trees, each spreading its branches five meters across. Nobody quite knows how it happened. The locals believe that a bird may have dropped a cherry seed on top of the mulberry tree. The seed grew roots that pushed through the mulberry tree's hollow trunk and reached all the way down to the soil below, letting it survive and grow into a full, healthy tree. Highly unusual, but it could be the reason. Number 4. The Beacon of Maracaibo, the Never-Ending Lightning Storm In western Venezuela, over the Catacumbo River, there is a storm that never ends. Starting at 7 p.m. every night, lightning crashes over the water for 10 hours, 260 nights each year. Nobody knows for sure why it happens. Up until recently, the leading theory was that it had something to do with uranium in the bedrock, although scientists are starting to doubt that. Today, the leading theory is a complicated one. It posits that the shape of the mountains causes warm winds to collide with cold air from the Andes. That collision is then fueled by the rapidly evaporating water below and methane from a nearby oil field. Nobody actually knows for sure why it happens, and everything about it is mysterious and creepy, including one moment in 2010 when it inexplicably stopped. One day, the storm just died down without explanation and seemed to be over. Then, after six weeks of silence, it sparked up again and has been raging ever since. Number 3. The Blue Pond of Hokkaido, the Kool-Aid-Covered Lake. The Kool-Aid-Colored Lake. On the Japanese island of Hokkaido, there is a lake that's unlike any other in the world. The water is a unique, electric shade of blue that shimmers and changes its shade when you look at it from different angles. As the seasons change, the water changes color even more, shifting through shades of blue and green. The lake was actually man-made. The locals set up a dam in the area and set up a reservoir where the water blocked by the dam could collect. To their surprise, the water it collected changed color. Scientists believe that the water's strange color comes from aluminum hydroxide particles that have mingled in with it. The particles reflect blue light unusually well, making its reflection of the sky above far more vivid than any body of water anywhere else on Earth. And with that, it's now time for today's subscriber pick. 
Today's photo was sent to us by one of our subscribers, so if you come across a photo online and want to know more details about it, just send it on over to us. We might even feature it on a future video. Number 2 This picture seems to be photoshopped, as we weren't able to find anything relating to it, which hints that it might not be real. But we get the idea why someone who would think of photoshopping two seats not mixing. They probably got the idea from the Gulf of Alaska, where two oceans meet. It's a place where two types of different waters meet but don't mix. It's been one of the biggest mysteries of this century, but the explanation for it was given not that long ago. The simplest answer to the question of why they don't mix is that both the waters are of a different type. The density is different and due to different minerals at the edge of the waters, the waters cannot mix together. It really is one of the unnamed wonders of the world. Number 1. Kawa Ijen, the volcano with blue lava. In Indonesia, there is a sulfur mine built into a volcano, and when the workers enter it at night, they turn off their lights. Not to save light, they don't want to just save electricity. They don't need them, because their way is lit by the strange, blowing glue liquid trickling down the side like lava. Kawa Ijen is often described as a volcano with blue lava, although scientists now know the blue trickle isn't really lava. It's sulfur. Sulfuric gases inside heat up and burst out of it, shooting blue flames up to 5 meters in the air. The gases then condense into liquid sulfur, which spills down the mountain slopes, looking like flowing neon blue lava. All the sulfur in the air makes it toxic, and researchers and photographers who visit it have to wear gas masks to stay safe. The workers in the mine do not wear them and suffer through the unbreathable air while they work in the light of a pale blue glow that's slowly killing them and is unlike anything in the world. And that's our list of 10 places on the planet that science cannot explain. Which one is the most fascinating and which is the one that you'd like to witness for yourself? Let us know in the comments below. And if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. And as always, Thanks for watching.